everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a little everyday makeup look. So I will be honest, I do not usually wear makeup every day, but when I do, this is the type of look I will be showing you. Not really like an intense type of look, like when I'm going out, it's just a everyday running errands, hanging out with friends type look. So yeah, I'm just going to get right into it and I hope you guys enjoy. Also this is my smoothie today. I really thought it was gonna be like a pinkish color because it's filled with berries. I just don't know why I didn't turn that color, but besides that, it is really good. I usually drink like green juices, but I thought I would switch it up. So this is a berry, ginger granola, um, almond milk, and then I added like some chia, chai seeds. I think they're chia, I don't know how to pronounce it, but I added those. And yeah, that is about it, and this is how it turned out. To start the look, I'm gonna be using my primers. My sister got me this from Christmas, and this is like my fifth time using it because I barely wear makeup, but it honestly works like a charm, I will tell you that. So, I'm gonna put, put this one on first, and then I'll use the spray after. Just gonna rub it in. And then I'm going to be using my spray. I'm going to dry it out a little bit. And is why I am doing this makeup look today is because I'm actually going on a double date with my sister and her husband and then me and Rob. I think we're gonna go to the mall and do a couple things. I'm not really sure. We haven't really planned it out completely, but we just thought we wanted to do something fun today since all of our day offs. Right now I am applying the CC cream. I did not realize how much I put on my lips by accident, so I had to wipe that off. I'm going to try the new Kylie Jenner. You can see the new Kylie Jenner concealer. My sister gave it to me, so I'm just gonna rate it myself. I haven't really seen anything about these, so I don't really know if it's good. This might be a darker shade to my skin color, so let's hope it matches. I'm barely using a mirror right now. I'm using the camera as a mirror. So let's hope this actually turns out good. But I also have like a mirror over here. So if I keep looking to the side, that is why. I just wanna make sure I'm blending it all in good. All right, so from what I can tell, it actually blends in really nice. Honestly, it's good, yeah. If I feel like it does a good amount of coverage. Um, I probably wouldn't wear it though if I was doing like a light, 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 light look. I would just wear my other one that I usually wear all the time. It's like a drugstore one that I got. I'm pretty sure I've shown you guys in a video, which is probably why I will just stick to the other ones I usually use. But now I am going to start baking under my eyes. So much going on right now because... Because it is almost the end of the school year and my teachers are fitting in so many assignments before we end for some reason. I really couldn't tell you why, so that's why I've been really busy. And then plus, I have, I have to start preparing for my next YouTube video because my next video is going to be a week of. And oh my gosh, I actually need to put too much right there. All right. So my next YouTube video is just going to be like a week of something and I have to start preparing for it. Alright, I just realized I like didn't show you a baking powder I was using. So this is the Laura Mercier. This is one of my favorite baking powders. It works so good. So usually when I bake, I do it under my eyes. I do it on the sides of my nose 
and between my eyebrows. I'll also do it on the side where I'm doing, if I'm doing like a big contour look, but I'm not gonna do a big contour look right now. I'm just gonna put a little bit of bronzer on. The reason why I bake in my T-zone is because it's so, it gets oily over time. So that's why baking powder actually helps a lot. But while it's baking, I'm gonna be using my Too Faced bronzer. I'm not gonna overdo it, but. I can barely see right now. I'm gonna have to look at this side again. I'm gonna do my forehead a little bit. And then my cheeks, I need to blend in a little more. I'm also just gonna do a little bit on my nose. Just to contour it a little bit, even though I am just using powder. So after that, I'm just gonna blend it in. And I'm just gonna use this brush to blend in my, my baking powder. So after that, I'm just gonna be using a little bit of blush. I'm using the Milani blush, which is so nice. Look at that color, so pretty. There we go. All right, so now I'm gonna apply it. In a different brush, so I had to go grab the correct one. So I'm gonna dab it a little bit because it's so thick already. I'm gonna put it on my cheekbone and then kind of go up to the top. <laughs> like, you see how thick it is already? Obviously, I'm not gonna put it like this, but that's how thick it is. Oh, I gotta do some serious blending now because I did that. All right, so now I'm gonna be using my highlight stick. This is my favorite thing in the world. It's already a little too much, so I'm just gonna use my finger. I'm also gonna go up to the top too when I'm using highlighter so it blends in with the blush. Honestly, it looks like such a natural glow, which was the point, so I'm glad. A bit on my nose. All right, so next thing is going to be my eyebrow gel. The Anastasia one is what I use. I think this is the best one to use. Gonna put on some mascara. I use the telescopic one. This you can find at any drugstore. Best one compared to all these expensive mascaras that are out there. I love this because it's such a light lip gloss. It's not too much. And the color is like neutral, so. All right, so this is the final makeup look. 
as you can tell it is really really late but that was the point because when i do go out run errands and do all these things i am going more for a neutral look but i'm very happy how this came out thank you guys so much for watching i will be back with more videos do not forget to like and subscribe